um, that would be delicious, but it makes me kind of sad. Alex, like, uh, can I just get back to what I was doing before the storm? You yeah, know? somebody needs to help them out, get yeah, back, in the, scoot them in there. back in the lake. But I, I'll, I'll tell you what, of all of the weird Florida critters that could be swimming outside your house in flood water, catfish, not the worst. Not even close. So, uh, hey, take that as a win if you can. Hey, we're starting out dry uh, here this morning, and it's still a little muggy outside, but uh, we've got drier air pushing as cold front pushes through the state. This is not going to bring cold air in, but it is going to bring more comfortable air in uh, over the next couple of days. Right now, it's still a little sticky, but that dry air will filter in behind the front. And for us, that means more comfortable weather as early as this afternoon. It's still going to be pretty hot, uh, but it will not be as hot and humid as the past couple of days. Temperatures in the low 90s this afternoon. No rain in the forecast through the day and a good bit of sunshine too. Temperatures right now sitting in the 70s and again, dew points are still in the 70s for us at this point. So it is still sticky outside for now, but those dew points actually trend down through the rest of the day and much of the day we'll see dew points in the 60s. Watch what happens this weekend though. That's when the really dry air starts to move in those dew points down into the 50s. That's really going to make things feel more comfortable. So today dew points in the 60s for much of the day. You're still going to have a heat index. It's just not going to be as high temperatures in the low 90s at heat index, mainly in the mid to upper 90s. But this weekend is when things start to feel more comfortable and much more noticeably so high still in the 90s Saturday and Sunday, but cooler air in place in the form of less humidity and that, that's really going to help things out. It also means cooler mornings on the way this weekend too. Now with the dry air in place, no rain in the forecast over the next few days, we will stay dry with that front keeping moisture trapped down to our south. No rain in the forecast for the weekend or start of next week, but eventually the humidity returns and with that at least some isolated showers and storms by the middle of next week. So today heat index still in the mid to upper 90s, not quite to the triple digits, but it'll still be hot, but no heat index Saturday, Sunday or Monday. And then with the humidity returning for the middle of next week, heat index back up into the low triple digits. But the weather this weekend will be quite nice, especially for this time of year for August low 90s with low humidity. That's about as good as you can ask for in central Alabama and check out the morning lows. They're dropping into the 60s Saturday, Sunday and Monday morning, so it won't necessarily feel refreshing, but it will feel much more comfortable for the weekend at start of next week, but it doesn't last. The humidity is starting to build back in for the middle of next week and temperatures trending up too. That'll bring that heat index back in the triple digits and we'll have a couple of hit or miss showers and storms by the middle of next week. Kristen. All right.